What up farm? How you going? So you can see the canola, it is starting to lose its flowers. It has all been yellow, very yellow, but that means that harvest and windrowing is not far away. So today we are working on the windrow front. I've already done some on the spray bar and straightened it up where it was broken off. I also welded up a crack here and the spray bar on this side. What we're doing now is we're putting a full new knife on. New knife guards, new wear bars and a full new knife coming in. I've got some helpers with me today. I've got my wife Chelsea. <laughs> She's repping the Merit Contracting Jumper. I'm proud. <laughs> and You can't hear it, but she's snoring and it's really cute. <laughs> so we've got a problem. We don't have enough washers. And we also are short one wear bar, which is a little frustrating, but we'll have to use one from last year. Time to find some watches. like the thickest. Yep. Is this thick enough, boss? Yeah, it looks good. Come on. Boss, I finished my job. What's next? You want to get the impact wrench yep. with a 14 mil socket yep. and a 14 mil spanner. Yep. And you can start tightening these up. Sure. Sounds great. In the in the driver's side toolbox on the U. Oh, yep. Sure. <laughs> Is that it? Yeah, it's yeah. bingo. The battery. I think I can do that one. Fourteen mils. Oh, they're in order. There you go, for once, a farmer's thing is in order. And what next? You proud? Very. Thanks. So apparently I've cross-threaded the, the the uh, screw. <laughs> <laughs> screw. A, the screw. Look at this screw. I'm gonna go check on our baby. I'm good at that job. Too 
Doesn't it have a quieter setting? <laughs> you can do it by hand. I can give you the ratchet. <laughs> this is Chelsea's first go at this. Perfect. Yeah. Oh, no. Hey Alex, you're awake. Alex and I have decided to go for a bit of a walk. Huh? Were you a bit upset? <laughs> Mark's listening to a banger. <laughs> Do you not like this song? <laughs> no. <laughs> See you girls. Uh, it's fun. It's fun having a family on a farm. <laughs> Good morning guys. So this morning I've gone along, tightened up all the knife guards. They're all on there with the new wear bars. So that's looking good. And now I've just um, taken a bearing out of one of the draper rollers. On this end, I've already put a new bearing in and I'm gonna put a new bearing in this end. All right, just put the um, new bearing in. This one's done. Now we're gonna pull the old bearings out of the other roller. So all this stuff is just preventative maintenance. So we fix it now. The bearings, they're still good, but if we fix them now, we won't have to do it in the season, like when we're wind rowing. Um, and if we don't have to stop in the season, that means more time to work, less downtime, and less stress. Okay, that's another another bearing replace. This time, maybe I'll show you how to get the old one out. So this is the old bearing that I'm replacing. So as you can see, there's this uh, circlip. Just take them out. Now you got to get the the bearing out. So I'll use my slide hammer. There we go, got it out. Get the new one out. Here we go. Clean it up just a little bit. Get some of that junk out. Now I'll get a, bit of, a little bit of grease. Just smear around there. This just makes it easier for next year. And we line our bearing up.
grab our grab our block of wood and hammer. There we go. She's in. Let's clean out the circlip groove. Make sure it's all open. Put our circlip back in. And now that's the bearings on the idler roll that's changed. There we go, those two are ready to go. So, just been called down to mum and dad's place and we've sold this sprayer. The people who are coming to pick it up that have bought it, they're coming right now. So, won't be long and we'll no longer be owners of a gold acres. There it goes. The end of an era. Hey guys, so we, after lunch, after we had some lunch, we went on a, on a crop walk looking for some stripe rust that is uh, starting to become visible in our area. But unfortunately our, our crops, our wheat is too, too advanced and we actually, we can't, we can't spray any fungicide on it to prevent that. So. It'll just have to be what it be's. But, um, and then the salvo for this evening, we just cleaned out all the nozzles on the sprayer and rinsed that out. Um, and it'll be right to go. So, yeah. Thanks for watching. If you haven't already, subscribe down below, leave a comment, give the video a thumbs up. And yeah, as always, stay safe. Stay cool.